A popular treat is being recalled. Major Tonight, food warning this hour. Nestle is recalling its Toll House refrigerated cookie dough. The Food dough. and Drug Administration is warning Americans not to eat raw Nestle Toll House cookie dough amid fears of E. coli contamination. I'm donned in my protective gear today because we're dealing with hazardous waste, essentially. This is cookie dough, and people apparently eat raw cookie dough, and they get sick. Now, today is Saturday, June 20th, and yesterday morning, Nestle recalled its cookie dough because there's 66 people sick with E. coli 0157H7 in 28 states. And based on interviews with people, it was raw cookie dough that my colleague happened to manage to go buy at the store. So this could be potentially E. coli laden um, cookie dough. What we're going to do today is a little experiment because I want to see how hot it gets. The company said, well, we care about consumers, so we're going to recall everything. But you know what? If you're just careful with it, you won't get sick. This is what raw cookie dough looks like. And this is the refrigerated kind and you buy it at the store. And it says on here, keep refrigerated, use before date on package, and do not eat unbaked cookie dough. And it's in really, really tiny letters. If you're not supposed to eat this raw, now everything that's on here, that's on my hands, is contaminated. Those scissors, they should go straight into the dishwasher, which I'm going to do. Uh, now I'm going to contaminate it. So all of this stuff is potentially contaminated with raw product. Into the oven they go for, as the instructions say, 10 to 12 minutes. Some say 10 to 14. Let's go 10 and see what happens. Okay, it's been about 11 minutes at a 350 degree oven. Hmm, these cookies look pretty big. You can tell I don't do the cookie thing very often. But, uh, let's see, I'm sure they, they probably got the temperature, but I just want to verify. So I've got my tip-sensitive digital thermometer here. Yeah, I've got to, it's reading 185 at this point. So, that would take care of anything if there was some bacteria there. But again, the risk with these things is don't eat raw. The FDA, the Food and Drug Administration, is saying if you have any of these nesting things, throw them out. Do not try to cope with them because the risk of cross-contamination is just too high. But in the end, I think we need much better labels as a start on these sorts of things because there's just too many sick people.